Imagine a world where art, religion, and history intertwine to create a profound enigma. This is the world of the Da Vinci Code. The Da Vinci Code, penned by the skillful hand of Dan Brown, is a thrilling concoction of mystery, suspense, and intrigue. Published in 2003, this novel has since anchored itself into popular culture, selling over 80 million copies worldwide, and sparking a wildfire of debate and conversation. This riveting narrative is not just a novel, it's an exploration into a world of hidden truths and concealed secrets, a world where every painting holds a message, every symbol has a story, and every piece of history may not be as it seems. Our journey today orbits around the heart of this mystery-laden universe, the cryptic enigmas embedded in the Da Vinci Code. This masterpiece of storytelling is more than just a work of fiction, it's a labyrinth of codes, symbols and secrets all waiting to be deciphered. The story unfolds through the eyes of Robert Langdon, a symbologist who unwittingly becomes entangled in a clandestine battle between the Priory of Scion and Opus Dei, two conflicting societies with roots reaching deep into the annals of Christianity. Yet the novel is more than just a thrilling ride through a world of secrets. It's a mirror held up to history, reflecting a different image of the past, one that challenges our understanding of religion, art, and the very roots of Western civilization. The mysteries of the Da Vinci Code are not just puzzles to be solved, they're questions to be asked. Questions about faith, about history, and about the very nature of truth itself. They are questions that have stirred controversy, sparked debate, and for some, change the way they see the world. So, fasten your seatbelts, open your minds, and brace yourselves. We're about to embark on a journey through the looking glass and into the heart of one of the greatest mysteries of our time. Prepare to delve into the labyrinth of secrets and symbols that is, the Da Vinci Code. In the heart of this enigma, lie a fascinating plot and intriguing characters. The Da Vinci Code, a captivating novel by Dan Brown, unfolds a riveting tale of mystery and historical intrigue. At the center is Robert Langdon, a Harvard symbologist, and Sophie Naveau, a French cryptologist, who find themselves entangled in a web of secrets and riddles. The story begins with the murder of Jacques Saunière, the curator of the Louvre Museum, who is found in a bizarre pose mimicking Leonardo da Vinci's Vitruvian Man. This sets off an exhilarating chase for the Holy Grail, a quest that takes our protagonists through the winding streets of Paris, the hallowed halls of the Louvre, and the enigmatic Rosslyn Chapel in Scotland. As Langdon and Naveau delve deeper, they discover that Saunière was part of the Priory of Sion, a secret society that included historical luminaries like Isaac Newton and Leonardo da Vinci. The society's mission, it seems, is to protect an earth-shattering secret. The Holy Grail isn't a cup, but a metaphor for Mary Magdalene, who, according to the novel, bore a child by Jesus, thus creating a bloodline that still exists. Adding another layer to the story are the Knights Templar, another ancient society that has sworn to protect this sacred bloodline, and the Opus Dei, a Catholic organization depicted in the novel as willing to go to great lengths to suppress this secret. Standing in the shadows is the calculating and sinister Sir Lee Teabing, a British historian who adds a twist to the tale. His knowledge about the Grail's history and his ulterior motives make him a captivating character, adding to the novel's spellbinding allure. These characters, each with their own secrets, make the journey through the Da Vinci Code a thrilling adventure. As they decipher codes, unravel historical mysteries and dodge danger at every turn, they draw us into a world where nothing is as it seems. Intrigue, danger and secrets are the companions of our characters as they navigate the labyrinth of the Da Vinci Code. The Da Vinci Code is a tapestry of art and history, each thread contributing to the overall mystery. This statement rings true as we delve deeper into the intricate world that Dan Brown has woven. The novel is a masterful blend of historical fact and artistic license, creating a captivating narrative that keeps readers on their toes. A central character in the story, and indeed its namesake, is the renowned artist and inventor, Leonardo da Vinci. His enigmatic paintings, especially The Last Supper and The Mona Lisa, serve as vital clues in the quest for the Holy Grail. Brown's interpretation of these masterpieces, whether accurate or not, has undoubtedly sparked intrigue and debate about the hidden meanings that may lie within them. The novel also takes us on a thrilling journey through some of the world's most iconic historical sites. From the labyrinthine Louvre Museum in Paris, where the story begins with a puzzling murder, to the enigmatic Rosslyn Chapel in Scotland, where the protagonists hope to find answers.
These settings are not just chosen for their aesthetic appeal, but for their historical significance and the secrets they are believed to hold. Brown also delves into the shadowy world of secret societies, particularly the Priory of Sion and the Knights Templar. While these organizations are real, their depiction in the novel is largely fictional. The Priory, for instance, is portrayed as the keeper of the Holy Grail secret, a claim that has been widely debunked by historians. Then there's the controversial Opus Dei, a Catholic organization portrayed in the novel as a sinister sect. In reality, while Opus Dei is a deeply conservative group, it does not engage in the kind of nefarious activities depicted in the novel. In the end, what sets the Da Vinci Code apart is not just its thrilling plot, but the way it intertwines art and history, fact and fiction. It invites us to question, to seek, and to wonder. And though it may not always stick to the historical script, it certainly makes for a captivating read. Art and history are not just backdrop in the Da Vinci Code but are integral to its enigma. The Da Vinci Code is not just a novel, it's a conversation starter on faith, reason, and the role of women in Christianity. One of the central themes of the Da Vinci Code is the conflict between faith and reason. The book challenges traditional religious beliefs, offering alternative interpretations that invite readers to question their own faith. It suggests that faith is not about blind acceptance, but about seeking the truth, even if it contradicts established dogmas. This theme resonates with many, especially in an age where reason and science often clash with religious doctrines. The role of women in Christianity is another significant theme. The book proposes that Mary Magdalene was not a prostitute, as often depicted, but a revered figure, even suggesting that she was the wife of Jesus and bore his child. This radical reinterpretation seeks to restore the divine feminine in Christian tradition, which has been largely patriarchal. It encourages us to rethink the role and status of women in religion and society. The quest for truth and meaning in life is another recurring theme. The protagonist's journey to unravel the secrets of the Holy Grail symbolizes our own search for understanding and purpose. This theme taps into our innate desire to know the truth, to make sense of the world, and to find meaning in our existence. My personal take on these themes is that The Da Vinci Code is a thought-provoking novel that encourages us to question established beliefs and seek our own truth. Whether or not we agree with its interpretations, it opens a dialogue on important issues that are often ignored or avoided. However, it's crucial to remember that The Da Vinci Code is a work of fiction, and its claim should be taken with a grain of salt. While it invites us to question and explore, it's not a definitive guide to history or religion. We should approach it with an open mind but also with critical thinking. The Da Vinci Code invites us to question, to seek, and to discover. The Da Vinci Code has left an indelible mark on literature and popular culture. This intricate tapestry of historical references, art and religion, masterfully woven by Dan Brown, didn't just sit on the bestseller list for weeks on end, it also sparked a global conversation. It's not an exaggeration to say that The Da Vinci Code turned the literary world on its head. First published in 2003, the novel quickly catapulted to the top of the charts, selling over 80 million copies worldwide. It was translated into 44 languages, making its intriguing narrative accessible to a global audience. But the impact of The Da Vinci Code extends beyond the printed page. The novel's popularity led to a film adaptation in 2006 starring Tom Hanks as the brilliant Harvard symbologist, Robert Langdon. It was an international box office success, raking in over $750 million and bringing the novel's complex mysteries to a wider audience. The film also spawned several sequels, further cementing the tale's place in popular culture. The novel's blend of history, art and religion also sparked a surge in related books and documentaries. Scholars, historians and enthusiasts alike dove headfirst into the topics Brown touched on, leading to a wealth of new research and exploration. This has led to a better understanding of the themes and historical periods referenced in the novel. However, it's not just about the numbers or the spin-offs. The real impact of The Da Vinci Code lies in the conversations it started and the questions it raised. It challenged readers to think critically about history, religion, and the role of women in Christianity. It brought to the forefront a fascinating, albeit controversial, reinterpretation of historical events and figures. The Da Vinci Code remains a cultural phenomenon, its mysteries still captivating audiences around the world. Whether you're a history buff, a mystery aficionado, or just someone who enjoys a good read, The Da Vinci Code has something for everyone.
The legacy of this novel is a testament to the power of storytelling and the enduring allure of the unknown.